What's up, everybody? This is Teacher Israel from Evolution Series. This is our final week. Today, we will talk about affirmative and negative there plus B in past and present. Remember, you have to practice all your autonomous activities using your digital and printed books. For the affirmative grammar structure in past, we have there plus was plus article plus a noun. For example, there was a car. For the negative structure in past, we have there plus wasn't plus article plus noun. For example, there wasn't a driver. Now, for the affirmative grammar structure in present, we have there plus is plus article plus the noun. For example, there is an accident. And for the negative grammar structure in present, in singular, of course, there plus isn't plus article plus the noun. There isn't an ambulance. And now let's move to the plural forms. There, where, a quantifier or a number, and the noun. There were many students. For the negative grammar structure in past, there plus weren't plus quantifier or the number plus the nouns. There weren't a few students. For the affirmative grammar structure in present, in the plural form, there plus are plus quantifier number, plus the noun. There are some apples. Now for the negative, there, plus aren't, plus quantifier or the number, plus the noun. There aren't a hundred apples. Now, Remember that these activities are just a review. We are on evaluation week. Chicos, recuerden que estas actividades son solamente de repaso. Estamos en semana de evaluación y por lo tanto debemos de entender cómo vamos a utilizar estas estructuras y estas oraciones en nuestro producto integrador. Aquí tenemos un ejemplo. Let's look at this example. In Octopan, there was an underground parking lot a few years ago. But now, there is a parking lot below the street in front of Bancomer and the Hotel Convento. Recuerden que para sus oraciones tenemos que mencionar el lugar del que estamos hablando. In Octopan. Después, hacemos un comparativo pasado-presente utilizando el conector de contraste que ya habíamos trabajado en lecciones pasadas, que es but, con la expresión de tiempo now, pero ahora, es decir, hago un contraste entre el pasado y el presente. Lugar, in Actopan. The sentence in past. There wasn't an underground parking lot a few years ago. No había un estacionamiento subterráneo hace algunos años. Pero ahora, but now, there is a parking lot below the street in front of Bancomer and the Hotel Convento. Pero ahora, 
tenemos un estacionamiento debajo de la calle que está enfrente de Vancomer y el Hotel Convento. De esta manera, elaborarán sus oraciones afirmativas y negativas para su producto. Recuerden verificar la rúbrica que se encuentra en sus libros digitales e impresos. Thank you.